We are back with Today Food. This morning, we have Maya Camille Bosarab here with us to make one of her famous pies. You probably know her from the Netflix show Bake Squad. Mm -hmm. And then she joined me last year on my Cooking Up a Storm podcast Beautiful. for Thanksgiving. Well, she just released her new cookbook. It's called Justice of the Pies, which is also the name of her Chicago bakery. Maya not only bakes amazing pies, she also helps teens experiencing food insecurity by teaching them about nutrition and about baking. Hi, good morning. Good it's morning. It's so nice to have you here. Yes. Okay, so your me. your father was a criminal defense attorney, mm -hmm. um, and you love baking pies. So this is kind of how <laughs> this whole dream came to life. Tell us about it. Yeah, so my dad was obsessed with making pies, and he passed away in 2009. So I created this bakery in his memory to celebrate his love of pies and to honor his belief that people deserve second chances. Oh, and each great. pie is kind of dedicated to someone, right? Well, in the book, I do interview 10 people who use their work to positively impact the lives of others, and then I created a recipe inspired by their work. Oh, I That's love that. Great. That's wonderful. Okay, right. so we're getting started. This is, I, I love the, the crust right from the beginning. I know, it so smells it's, so it's, good. It can only get better. From, from here. So this is our lemon espresso pie. So I'm going to take one tablespoon of uh, ground espresso mm -hmm. and three tablespoons of melted butter. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to combine that together until it gets nice and moist. Okay. Then we're going to put that into a pie plate and press it down. Now I like to use a flat bottom to kind of help me press it down. You can use a measuring cup or a, uh, a drinking glass. Mm -hmm. And we kind of tamp that down until it's nice and Okay. Then we're going to move on over to our custard. So this is the lemon custard, which is something that we also, it's very similar to like a key lime pie. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here's the trick. The egg yolks will loosen the sweetened condensed mixture. Oh. So what I do is I put the sweetened condensed milk in first and then mix that together and then the proteins with the, uh, in the milk will interact with the acidity of the lemon juice and oh. it will thicken. But for a little oh, bit of extra pucker, we mm -hmm. could put some lemon zest in there okay. as well. Mm -hmm. So we're going to combine that first, put lemon zest in, and then pour in our lemon juice and okay. combine that as well. And if you find that your mixture is still a little bit loose, mm -hmm. then you can let it sit for five minutes. Oh, okay. and it'll Then up. once it is done, we're going to pour that into our um, pie Yummy dish. Base here. Well, we're going to whisk that. Yeah. There we go. Okay. We'll pour that into our pie dish. Okay. But this is a very lemony pie. Mm -hmm. okay. I like a little bit of, <laughs> little bit of little, pucker. Yes. So in addition to having a, um, a custard filling, we also have a lemon curd that goes on top. Oh, so we're going to have nice. a water bath and we're going to bring the water to a simmer. And here we're going to combine egg yolks with granulated sugar. Mm -hmm. Okay. A little bit of salt. Salt helps bring out the flavor, and then more lemon juice, mm. and then we will cook that until the um, until the mixture leaves a trail when you run a spoon across oh, the top. Okay. okay. So what you have to do, you just got to keep stirring. This is like this a is real deal. You got to babysit it. Mm -hmm. This is your so baby. You got to babysit this it. This is not baked. This is baked. Oh, it is. Okay. Baked. Not okay. only is this baked, but it's chilled for six hours. Oh, okay. Because it has to be nice and firm. Mm -hmm. Bacon and chill. Say that again? The bacon chill. Yep. Yes. And so we now have the lemon uh, custard that is chilled. We have our lemon curd, Ooh. which is also chilled. Oh and we're going to take that and put mm. it on top and just spread it about. Oh, mm. my goodness. So that we know, have like a nice. I can't wait. Uh, you can see that I love seeing like the two different colors mm -hmm. of uh, yellow. Okay. And now my favorite part. <laughs> I know. I can't wait. <laughs> is uh, definitely eating it. You make it so pretty. It so we're going to so take a slice. So now what about this little part up here? You just add some little Oh, grizzlies. yeah. Take a slice of pie. Okay. And then we're going to add homemade hot fudge sauce, which oh, is God. also in mm. the book. Mm. And I like, so I like to put oh it on God. a plate, but then sometimes I get a little, you know, oh, extra. Yeah. Yeah. Homemade hot fudge. Oh, oh, my God. I love this. Oh, this oh. is chantilly cream. You could just put wow. a dollop. Oh my goodness. I don't even like lemon and I oh. love this. <laughs> like and then we'll that take is a pie. amazing. Thank you. Now, this is a cold pie, and people tend to think that cold pies are good for summer, but this mm. is actually a winter pie because that is when the citrus fruit is in season. Oh. oh. Look but at that. the that is, is it's delicious. Maya Mouth Camille. Pucker, too. This mm. is fantastic. Maya Camille, thank you mm. so oh my much. Justice of the pies. Mm. Justice mm. of the pies. To uh, learn this recipe, go oh to today.com slash food. And Maya Camille's new cookbook, Justice of the Pies, is out today.